guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I thought it would be a really cool, fun, I don't know. Uh. So today I thought it would be really fun if I filmed a night routine. So that's what you're about to see in a couple of minutes. But before I get onto the video, I just wanted to say, if you haven't subscribed already, go ahead and subscribe down below. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And I actually just released a podcast. My last video that I made previous to this one actually was a video announcement for the podcast. But if you haven't listened to it already, definitely go check it out. It's on YouTube and SoundCloud under the username 1998podcast. We also have an Instagram page at 1998podcast. We do a lot of cool things on our Instagram. We post about upcoming future episodes. We post um, polls and questions and just little things like that. And I think that's all I wanted to say to you guys. So without further ado, let's get on with this night routine. Hey guys, so my night actually starts with me taking a nap. I know that sounds kind of ridiculous, but after coming home from a long day, I am so exhausted. So I like to take off my glasses and snooze a little bit before I actually get on with the rest of my evening. I usually try to set my alarm for an hour and a half. So after that goes off, usually around like 6.30, depending on when I take my nap, I usually grab my phone. Well, first I guess I put on my glasses so I can even look at my phone. And I look through Instagram or YouTube just to see you know, what has been going on the rest of the day while I was at school. And I just kind of chill in bed until I basically gain up the courage to leave the comfort of my room and go and make dinner. Lately, I've been on a recipe kick. I really, really love cooking, guys, and I highly recommend it. Um, I want to do more cooking in 2019, so what I've been doing is finding just random recipes online. Granted, they are vegan, so whatever your diet preferences are, you know, there are billions and billions of recipes. <laughs> this is funny. <laughs> Um, there are billions of recipes online. You just have to Google what you're into. So on this night, I Googled a recipe for vegan pasta and I found this really awesome butternut linguine pasta recipe um, that I have never tried before. And guys, it was so freaking good. So I just cut up all of my veggies. I cut up onion and garlic and the butternut squash and I am sauteing them in oil. I usually don't like to cook in oil, but um, I thought, you know, for the sake of this video and for trying something new, why not? It doesn't matter. It doesn't hurt to have a little bit of oil here and there. I think it's really fun to try new things and um, to just kind of open up your flavor palette a little bit. Plus experimenting with food, I tend to always stick to cooking the same foods and it kind of gets boring after a while, not going to lie. I also like to cook while I'm listening to a podcast or music. And on this night, I was watching uh, YouTube videos. So, yeah. And then I took all of those veggies that I was sauteing in the oil and I put them in my blender and it basically it turns into kind of like a thick creamy sauce and i just turned my blender on and let that baby go And then I transferred all my pasta into the same pan that I was using to cook the veggies and I poured the puree mixture over the pasta and I just mixed it in a little bit and made sure that every noodle was incorporated into the sauce. And then I pulled out some baby spinach that we had in the fridge and I put that alongside my pasta. I really want to eat more greens as well. I usually have a salad every day at lunch for school, but because we are on a different schedule now, since it is the new year, we get home early, so I'm trying to incorporate more greens. And then I took a shower on this night, and I am basically doing my skincare routine. 
I'm not going to tell you exactly what I'm putting on my face and what I did in the shower just because if you guys want an updated skincare routine, I will gladly let you know about it. But I have been using serums, preferably a rose hip oil, and it's done wonders to my skin, guys, honestly. Like, it's it's awesome I would highly recommend so usually I brush my teeth and after I brush my teeth I floss my teeth as well what a beautiful shot and because I have Invisalign I also have to clean out my aligners which is kind of annoying but you do what you got to do so I do this every morning and every night as you can tell and I just clean them brush them with a toothbrush and um, a little bit of hand soap, antibacterial hand soap, and then I just pop those suckers right back in. And I put on my glasses, and I am ready to go into my bed. Now lately what I've really been loving is turning on my essential oils diffuser. So I just put in a little bit of water in there, and then I drop in a couple of drops. I've really been loving this lemongrass essential oils that I got a couple of I think last year actually um it just makes the room smell so freaking good lemongrass is one of my favorite scents little fact of mine <laughs> and so I just pop the top back in put it back into place and I turn it on and it makes my whole room smell amazing and I've also been loving lighting up candles in my room so this is a candle that my boyfriend actually got for me for Christmas. It's a lemon candle from Bath and Body Works and it just makes my whole room very, very cozy. Now, one of my New Year's resolutions is to actually journal more. So this is what I've been trying to do every night before I go to bed. Right now, I'm just crossing off some things for my agenda. I am a huge planner, so I love making a list in the morning and then checking off the things that I've done um, throughout the day. So here I am journaling and just writing down my thoughts for the day. I really think that journaling is super important, um, especially for me. I tend to bottle up my emotions. I know that's not always the best thing to do, but that's what I do and I'm working on it. But I like to kind of reflect on my day and the thoughts that I've had and what I've learned. So that's... That's what I'm doing. And I'm also a huge avid reader if you didn't know that about me. So I am trying to finish my days with um, just cuddling into bed and reading my book. Um, I have been trying to read this book by Stephen King for <laughs> literally months now and I keep renewing it at the library, but <laughs> you know, what can I do? So I hope you guys liked this video. That was basically the end of my night routine. Um, let me know in the comments down below what video suggestions you guys have for me, if there are any, and I will see you guys all next time. Bye!